Boys here at Teddy Bears El Paraíso are still traumatized when an armed robber walked into the store nearly three months ago. All of it was caught on camera. For the past three months, I get nervous. I don't feel safe. Eliseo Francisco has feared for his life while working at the Teddy Bears El Paraíso store in Mesa. The trauma of being robbed at gunpoint, kicking in every time he clocks in. You can tell when someone has the intention to do a lot of harm. I saw that in his eyes. This is the moment on April 16th, Francisco replays in his head. A man concealing his face walks in with a gun. He tells customers, including children, to move to the corner of the room. Francisco says he remembers seeing the kids shaking. Then the robber demands money and checks from Francisco, who had his nine-year-old son with him behind the register. When he pointed the gun at me, I knew he would shoot me if I didn't give him what he wanted. At that moment, I pray to God to help me because it was life or death. The suspect eventually leaves without hurting anyone. Francisco says the store also transfers money to other countries and believes that's why they were robbed. However, he says they don't keep a lot of money in the register. But since the suspect is still on the loose, they've installed a barrier around the register and a new door chime. I would feel more calm when he's arrested and not able to do this again. If you have any information that could help lead to the suspect's arrest, you're asked to call Silent Witness. There is a $1,000 reward. Reporting in Mesa, Casey Torres, Arizona's family. New